All right, what's up, guys? So, I am okay. So, yeah, obviously, I did get a haircut for my last videos. Not this one, though, that you're gonna see because, uh, yeah, anyways. <laughs> so, I am super excited to start this intro off and tell you guys we hit 100 subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much. Uh, this is a goal I had set. Uh, way back in the beginning, I said I wanted like 100 subscribers by summertime. Um, I hit 50 subscribers and I decided, hey, July 4th would be a perfect time to hit that. So, and we hit it today, which will be going up for you guys July 2nd. And we nailed it. Alright, anyways guys. So, I just want to do a real quick shout out. Thank you guys so much. That's huge for me. And uh, I'll get right into this video. Hope you guys enjoy the raking. Hey there guys, hope you guys are having an awesome day today. Uh, it is June the 22nd and I'm out here and I'm going to rake the, uh, the power station field that I cut in my last video. I am actually uh, in the process of uploading it right now, I've only got like half hour left or so. So that will be up to you guys today, which I don't know when you guys will be seeing this, but uh, anyway guys. I'm gonna get rolling and uh, I'll give you the specs on the on the uh, good old rake here. So the rake we are using is the VR1022. It's just the normal V rake with five wheels on it, or ten if you want to do side to side. But it's a five wheel one way, five wheel the other. And uh, this rake has different. Um, hydraulic rams and you can shut one off so say you just want say this side down all you have to do is come over here to this shut off valve bring this bring them up pop that like that pop the lever like that and then it's locked and this side cannot do anything or if you want them both down like what we're gonna be doing I'll have them both unlocked so that they can both go up and down so that's pretty much it I mean it's it's a rake but I'll uh, get to go in here and I'll explain what to do and how to do it on the way in. So, see you then. I remembered I forgot to tell you guys how we adjust the arms back and forth or up and down or whatever. Um, so these arms, they, you take out this pin, this cotter pin, then you take out the actual pin here. And you can slide it out or in. And each one of these little holes is spaced to where it'll give you um, a wider windrow or a narrower uh, windrow. And then also right here, what we have is see this stop here. It hits on this pin and that's when the rake knows to stop. So you can adjust your float basically or how you want the rake to sit on the ground just by moving that pin into one of these different holes and both sides have it. So, anyways, uh, that's about it for the rake. I'm gonna go finish up this third row and then I'll start filming. And if you're 
you're wondering why we why I do that or why we do that, it's to make it a lot easier on the baler. Then the baler doesn't have to keep on turning every single lap around. He only, the baler only has to go those three rounds that turn. So the rake, like I said, you know, we did the three rounds and we go back and forth. But the reason why I had to do the three rounds first is because that's how we the tractor is allowed to turn at the end of our row. So it takes up those three rows of space, turns around, and comes back down the other way, braking. So that's what uh, you guys saw, and maybe you guys were wondering, that's why we do it, or that's just the tip of what we do. So anyways, I'm gonna get going on this field, and then I'll uh, get some more footage for you guys. Well guys, I'm over here on the uh, lake field about ready to cut some hay and uh, I realized that I had forgotten to outro my raking video. So we got it all raked, or I got it all raked I guess, and then when I got done um, I had to leave and then dad came and bailed up about 50 bales or something he said. So um, anyways, I'll get to getting, um, getting a bailing video done. And I decided what I'm going to do is since on the power station I did a separate mowing video and now a separate rake video, I'm going to do a separate ba bailing video on that field. And then for the rest of the fields, I'm just going to do each field as one video. So I'm going to have a little bit of cutting, a little bit of raking, a little bit of bailing. So anyways, I hope you guys like that. Sorry I've been slow in my daily videos. This is why. And if you want me to continue on my daily videos, let me, do let me know down in the comments and I will see you guys in another video. See ya.